Mr. Paul Nottengum, welcome to Cine Now. We are on the IFA 2007, and you are the president of Mio Technology Europe. Can you introduce a bit the company, yourself, and what you're doing, and let's go after it to this to this remarkable presentation. Well, thanks for introducing. I'm actually Paul Nottengum, heading uh, Mio Technology Europe. I'm very proud uh, for the team. We introduced our first products in 2004. Mio Technology was uh, introduced that time frame, and we have major three product lines, which is the PDA the, with the integrated GPS antenna, the PND, and the smartphone. So since 2004, we have grown uh, for about uh, eight times, and today we are a team with about 60 people, and we are taking the number three position in the European market with about 10% market share on the PND devices. For the uh, PDA devices with integrated GPS, we take about 50% and we are number one. So today, uh, in the IFA show, we have a very impressive uh, feature to show you on our new products, which is the uh, C620. And we talk about the... This uh, GPS. Exactly. There's that's, Im that's impressive. It's not a GPS for a truck, but it's <laughs> a, a big size GPS, as you can see. And uh, Ewan van Ende, which is our product manager, uh, will show you briefly the features of uh, the 3D landmark, which so now you can see we, in UK. We are in London. Exactly. So you are in London, you see uh, the landmarks, which are uh, the real pictures of the buildings. And we have about uh, 1,000 landmarks spread over about 30 uh, countries within Europe. You can uh, easily identify as well, on top of the 3D landmark feature, we also have the elevation mode, which uh, we will show you later on. So based on the Teleatlas map data, we compile into our products. Atlas is also providing all the uh, features in order to make it able uh, to enable us to have this kind of uh, extraordinary features in our products. That, and that's, that's very, very impressive. I mean, well, it's not only the features we can implement, but you also implement the speed of usage. And like you can see, it is a real time movement, which is very attractive for the consumer to play around and to see really the direction he is uh, driving. So he, f in fact, can recognize the position and the location he is in much more easy by using those kind of 3D landmarks. So we're on the 3D system. I mean, it's, it's, we, we can see everything, we can see everywhere. And I think you have... Well, yeah, like... We, we are now in Bern, Switzerland. We are actually in... Uh, here we are in Bern. You can see slightly besides the 3D landmarks, you also have the elevation mode. You can see the bridge and the area is slightly going down. Once we go to the mountains, we have a much more act uh, accentuation of this uh, elevation mode, which yeah, is in fact a combination of uh, pictures from uh, uh, top view pictures which has been integrated by Teleatlas as well as uh, local uh, data which has been collected input and, yeah. and input in our database. Also all the information are in, I mean speed limit and parking and, and probably some other features as... Besides the navigation we also have uh, the information you have on uh, as, a, as a driver well, the reaction is very, very fast. You, you also can see, of course, your distance, the speed you're running, the time to drive. And on the right-hand side, we are working on a 4.3-inch screen. And a 4.3-inch is not just enlarging the screen, but it's also giving more information. And this is what we are strong in. We are able to implement the latest technology in our products today. And like uh, Mr. Van Ende is showing, we have, besides navigation, we also have our phone, which you have a connection with Bluetooth. Automatically, when the phone comes in, you still keep your navigation ongoing, and you have your phone ongoing on the right-hand side. There is also the uh, MP3 player, which you can individual have a small player like now, or 
you can increase the sound while you are driving without very complex movements. Besides the MP3 player, you have a lot of other uh, tools uh, related, like maybe you can show some menu. So once you calculate the route, you immediately have the information of the three options you can take, the fastest, the shortest, or the route which are less turns. <laughs> And you can change it by color on the screen, and you can see which direction you are going. Well, so that's very, very complete. Yeah. Well, so maybe you want you can zoom in in this area here. Maybe we can uh, here you can see the elevation mode, which is a very impressive and. So you can really turn and see the way you are driving. And this is exactly what I just mentioned. Besides the 3D landmarks, we also have the elevation mode, which is another option. And we are the first one in worldwide to introduce this kind of features uh, today on a working product. Paul Lutenboom, thank you very much.